Here we go, man. Okay. Oh, boy. Oh, my goodness. This is insane. No wonder he's so confused. There's no one in the car. So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome to Hello Neighbor. It looks like we're revisiting this game, guys, because it has just updated. As you can see now, we're actually getting objectives towards this game. So it's not just kind of throwing us in, and we're not having no idea really what to do. So we've packed up, found a place, and then we've unpacked our stuff. Now we have to turn on the electricity, check inside, move stuff inside, and take a nap. Let's get ahead, and let's do that straight away. So the first step would be turning on the electricity. Press E to activate. Hey, is this house... Okay, everything has changed right here. I am now just realizing his house is entirely... <laughs> what? Is that a locomotive? Are you kidding me? Allow me to please go around the side of the house here. I saw something huge just move up there. And I know... There's a freaking... There is a locomotive built into this. Okay, right, no more questions. Let's get to the objective so we can get into this game. Turning on the power. There we are. And oh, we need a key for our door. So let me just go back, press F to pick up the key. And now we're going to go and use it on the door. So press the left mouse button to use the item. And the lock falls right off. And we can open our door into our new home. We can open our door. And here is our bed. So we now have some drawers right here. We also have a telephone. Let's take all the cardboard boxes. We also have an infantry. This is awesome. This game has changed so much from the pre-alpha that was just before. For. And I, I mean, I don't even know how much this... Everything has sound effects. I don't know if it did before. That might be just like an overly hyped <laughs> judgment right there. Wow, if you listen, it has sounds. Incredible. 10 out of 10 game. We may have a few more tools as well to help us break into the other house. We probably shouldn't have been putting things here anyway. I've just realized to probably put them in the bedroom. Let's just get them inside. Let's get this step done first. I guess we've technically moved enough stuff. Let's just take the rest. We've got some binoculars. So let's place this also inside. Everyone needs to play a little bit of basketball here and there. And we'll put the binoculars right there. Maybe for later use, but we will see. I think it's time for a nap. So firstly, let's close my front door, get the basketball in, don't let that thing escape, and close our other door to our bedroom, and let's enjoy this, so press E to sleep, here we go guys, it's nap time, and I'll see you guys bright and early, which I think is now in fact, oh, I was commentating about waking up after I'd already woken up, okay, about that. <laughs> So we have moved everything inside very successfully. We're now going to open our front door. And as you can see, the objectives are gone. And we are now back in. The house has changed tremendously. And also the graphical style has also changed a fair bit too. It looks a lot more kind of cartoony. I think it looks nice. This really suits the genre of the game and the appearance that the stranger had before. We're straight back in with the sound effects cueing us. Oh, the house layout is totally different. Uh, you know, the first thing I'm going to do though... Go I gotta ride that. I mean, who doesn't want to ride that thing? It's a straight... Oh, all right. I oh my goodness. I think he was literally right outside that door. Let me just try and sneak slowly. Okay, he's not. Let's go around the back of the house. We do have an electrical wire leading up. Let's make a plan of action here. Well, that's definitely something to do with the fuse right here. This is now the bathroom area. Yeah, it was a big bathroom last time. And let's look around the other side of the house. This looks to be his bedroom where he also has his binoculars right there. Okay, he's moving very close to me. I can hear it. That's now the kitchen. There we go. That's about everything on the exterior of the house. This is now the living room. There's the exit sign. Okay, we've got to get going straight away then. So, I mean, the first thing to try is the front door. So let's see if this opens. It does. And we are straight back in this house. We can go... Oh! Oh my goodness! Whoa! Okay, that sound is insane. Hang on. Am I standing up? Okay, run, 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 run. Wow! Okay, close the door behind us. Holy goodness, man. Has he changed as well? Let's just have a look at his appearance. Let's actually get the binoculars. Yeah, his art style has definitely changed his- Wait, does he ever- Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What the heck, dude? Right, that's it. If you're taking my house, I am taking your house. If that's how this is going to work, I'm going to play ball. And you know what? I'm going to agree to his shenanigans. He's literally in my bedroom. They've upped the neighbor's creepiness by like tenfold. But he's also given me a humongous window of opportunity. I feel like I should take this, but I also feel like that would be a bit cheap. This does give us time, in fact. Let us barricade the door, ladies and gentlemen. I may not actually beat this because this is not how the game's meant to be played. And of course, it's still in pre-alpha mode. He's uh, he's enjoying checking out my house. So, oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, let's just barricade the house as was before. And let's check out the creepiness to this guy's new house. This does give us a little bit of time. <laughs> Firstly, he's got like mannequins and everything around here. He's got a lot more room. So that door is in fact locked. He's definitely got a more. There is mannequins around every single. Okay, this is insane. The instruction. 
There is someone dead right underneath our feet. This now gives a lot more weight to this neighbor's creepiness. Okay, we're making a swift exit, so there is a shovel in this room. We're gonna remember that for now. Let's make our way through the other rooms. There's an elevator! Are you kidding me? That is insane, dude. Maybe that's the way we get upstairs if we can't get up the stairs at the time. This is the bathroom. Let's make an inventory check. So, nothing under there. We still do have the back room, which has the heater. Do we have the hammer anywhere around here? We do not. This is now the back entrance, though. Through here, we enter into his bedroom. And what is in here, apart from the binoculars, looks like nothing. Oh, so the hammer is located within the bedroom. I may actually use at least one of these steps. Why is this kitchen so trash, though, dude? Like, something happened here just before we broke in. I mean, no wonder he's been using the binoculars on us, you know, guys? With that friggin' dead person right underneath here, that door is shut because he barricaded that for a reason, even from himself. This is much darker than I first thought, guys. All right, and then in here, we don't have a whole lot in our inventory. We do have a switch to actually operate that. And in the living room here, we have the usual stuff. And we also have the exit sign right here. It looks like we don't actually have a key card anymore. Or at least a passcode we had to input on the wall. As you can see, there's no key. Let's head on upstairs and let's see what's going on up here. So, Okay, what the freak? There is a damn shark right there. Okay. Wow, my goodness! Wow. Wait, whoa! What the heck was that? Was that like a car or something? Just what is he up to down there? There is something really fishy going on. There's like an inside world in there? Are you kidding me? Look how he walks away. That strut, dude. Now the question remains, guys. Was that some kind of weird dream? Or did that really just happen? We've got to find this out. All right, so now it begins, guys. There goes the locomotive just over the top. Let's try and locate where the guy is before we do anything else. Maybe we can actually turn the power off. Let's see what this does. So if we flick the power, we heard it go off. Hold up. There is footsteps. He is intrigued as to how the power went off. What we need to hear out for now is a door opening or something. Because then that will tell us that he is most certainly coming to check on the power. Okay. He sounds really close by, man. Really close by. I don't want to make any, like, wrong moves here. There's two doors. Okay, this is good so far. Still good so far. Whoa, he's laid loads of bear traps down. He's really gone... He might be upstairs. If we sneak around like this, though, we may be actually able to... Is he entered or is he left? He may have turned the power back on. I really don't know, man. I really don't know. Dude, I have no idea, dude. This is really making me panic right now. There's so many footsteps and I don't know where they're coming from. Oh, okay, I think I've got to leave. The now new graphical style actually complements how scary this game is. It makes it feel so uneasy. All right, let's 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 try and work on this at least for now. So we're going to take the hammer. All right, we're going to have to place the chair there. All right, that's fine. It can bash on a... Are you kidding me? Really? Okay, that may have created a distraction. Hang on, let me see. Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my goodness, where am I? Okay, I don't know where I am. We're going to escape. We're going to escape. Wow! Okay, this phone needs to stop ringing. This feels too much like a horror movie cliche right here. Okay. Okay, he's watching. He's still coming! Dude, why is he still... Oh my god, he did! Oh my god! Jeez, dude! Okay, this is horrific. Maybe we could use this radio as a distraction. This neighbor is insane, dude. So, okay, we've thrown that just there. Let me just crouch. Okay, listen. Oh! What? From where? We've heard this sound before. Okay, now it's back to this style, huh? Is that how this is gonna play? And this gives us time. Okay, so open the door. Close it behind us. Barricade it. No, 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 no. Barricade it. There we go. You know what? Let's go and hide inside of his house. I think. Ah! Oh my god, man! What? How did he get- This is insane. I love this game. I love how this is developing right here. He's- he's emotionally upset. Hold up. You must be this tall to ride? This isn't- this is really bizarre, man. Can we get to- Hide in here. It says hide in here. Okay. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Okay, hide, hide. Guys, I don't know what's happening right here. Dude, I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. He captured us. What is up with that music, man? He's put a bear trap at the back door as well. He's still left this locked. Okay, so he's still quite smart. Why is that beeping? It's- ah! Oh my goodness, wow! He's gonna follow us, all right? He's gonna follow us, all right? So he came through the front door. We're gonna have to try and get in and hide somewhere inside of his house. Okay, nice and quickly here. Okay, keep going through the house. I don't think he's following us right here. Okay, let's go in here. Hide, 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 hide. Okay, hide. Okay, hide. Okay. We're hiding, guys. We're definitely hiding. He's right there. Okay, he knows we're there even though we're hiding. Is this game over? That's it. Okay, it's the cameras going off when that beeping is. I was just thinking to myself, why does it keep beeping? He's got cameras set up just there. Right, I'm running straight through his house. He's got security cameras absolutely everywhere. Okay, oh my god, what was that? What the heck? What the heck? What? Yeah, he's coming for me again. Let me just throw that there. Hello, neighbor. How are you? 
Are you good? What do you require from me? Would you like me to leave? I will actually get myself out of here if you move. But will you allow me to- Oh. Okay, this is weird. Can I actually sneak around him? No! No. Of course not. Okay. Can I destroy the cameras? Because these things are insane. They're everywhere. I can't just- I can destroy them! I can throw things at them! Can I throw them at him? Yeah, yeah, that's un he's unresponsive to them. Okay, I got through- I actually got through the shot bit, but I am- What?! Dude, what the heck is this stuff? This is ridiculously nuts. I need a gun. I need some other- What is this?! What?! Oh my god! Oh my god, what?! Oh my goodness, that is insane. Let me try and jump him. Wow! What the heck is this? Is this like water or something? I need the bell for this. The bell upstairs, that's for this. I need that bell for the dead thing down there. So I need to make the jump first. Okay, make the jump. Okay, and crouch. Oh my god, we did it first try. Do we have to make the jump back now? Okay, make the jump back. Jump. I did it, I did it, no way. If we put this on here... Oh my goodness, it worked. Oh my goodness, we're digging up something. Oh, it's a dead body, are you kidding me? How do we open this? There's a dead body down here. How do we open this? What? There's a mannequin inside? What's the dealio with this? I'm gonna keep carrying the- the woman with us? This has some kind of weird significance. Let me try and throw it at that. Okay, that didn't work. Uh, you're coming back with me. <laughs> so, let me try and hold, like, the left mouse button on this. No, nothing. It's- what about the nails, actually? We have to click on the freaking nails. Are you kidding me? Oh, there's another layer just down there. So let's, uh, let's get rid of, let's say, number one in our inventory. We've kind of done the digging right here. That's that all finished. Now all we have is this lock here. I'm not really sure how we can break that or if there is a way to. There's got to be a puzzle with this thing here. Like the, the old lady. Like I'm going to take the elevator up to the third floor. Maybe it'll be somewhere in here. Okay, take this chair. Then we'll open it. Oh my god! Oh my god! He's still in the house then. Two, there's mannequins pointing to places. Maybe inside here? Wait, no, 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 this can't be good. This is bad, this is bad. Let me try and run around him. I, I don't know, dude, there's, there's something to do with that lock there. Okay, guys, so I've restarted the game. I'm gonna try and get this on a fresh slate right here because I was struggling too much. There was everything going for me. I don't know, there wasn't really a way out of this. So, mm, I mean, now I, I just want to try and find a better method towards doing this. So we know... What, what does turning that do? That makes everything cold. I'm gonna get the bell before we do anything. So, it's for... Oh, it's for... No way. So that's... Oh, Dude, that's how we can do that. Let me try and open this door now. Let me see. We need a gun for this. That is nuts alone. We can't actually do anything without the gun. So, for rifle range, we get points for this? Okay, this is new. Um, what? We got a lock pick here. What the freak is this? Like a com command center? Let me try and- can I press that button? What the heck? Okay, I can turn it off. I don't know what that does. Maybe it's just another way to stop him or distract him from doing something. I just don't know what key we have to use to open this lock right here. I mean, can we use the hammer to like bat? Nah, it's got a specific key. Do not walk into that shark. It's right there. If we head back down nice and quickly, let's try this. Come on, please be the act. Oh my God, it actually worked. It actually worked. Oh my goodness, it actually worked. Whoa, no way. You savage, you freaking savage. Oh my goodness. What a savage. Are you kidding me? After all that, and then it, cr it crashes, are you kidding me? I don't even know if that was the end now. What? That could have been the end and it just crashed. No way. I want to do this again. God damn it, man. Oh, there we go. So now we open it. Okay, come on. Come on, give us a different ending this time, please. Don't crash. Okay, he does that. Then he takes us out, yes. And he buries us. But he, it should not crash. Come on, don't crash. Unless literally... Don't crash. That, oh, that is actually it. And then if we go new game, I guess it starts all over again. The whole sequence is as pretty much... I beat that again for nothing. Fantastic. <laughs> okay, guys, so I am going to finish this here. This has taken me two hours to do. Yes, no exaggeration. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. There is still like some small things I don't know about. Like there's a shooting range, there's like a control room. I don't know if those things have a purpose just yet. So maybe I can revisit this game even before the next update. I have gotten that close again to getting in the secret basement, but still it just pulls it away from me at the last minute. It's a shame, but we did technically get to the end of this new build of the game. So if you guys did enjoy this video, why not drop me that like button? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thanks so much for watching this video, guys. I of course hope you did enjoy, and I will of course see you on the next one.